guys welcome back to my channel so lately i haven't been uploading much as much videos as i would have liked to be but um there is a reason for that i started a new job and that job is monday through friday 8 30 to 5 30 so i kind of don't have as much time as i used to to just you know record um when there is daylight and you know just pretty much edit the video and get it up for you guys um i do have a uh, look that I've been wanting to edit for you guys and it's been a while but I'll promise I'm gonna get that up um so I decided to make it up and I'm going to be doing the vlogmas I'm going to try my best and do that because I know that if I have like a countdown to do I probably will have better luck filming I mean I don't have much going on in my life right now other than just working back but I will try to keep it productive and that way you guys can follow me in my journey to like um, Christmas shopping, maybe see a little um, wedding planning here and there. Um, let's see what else. Oh yeah, I started going to the gym so maybe like vlogging about the gym and stuff. I'm not a professional, just started so you guys can join me in my journey. Um, let's see what else. Well, today's vlog... I thought I would just kick it off with a um, tour of the beauty room and maybe a little bit of my apartment. Um, just because I never officially gave the tour. I mean, it's not complete and it's not done, but I just thought, why not kick off the first day of Vlogmas that way? Um, there's something else I wanted to say. I think that's it. But don't mind me. I was, we were running all over the place today. Um it's hot um oh yeah that's what i was gonna say so i wanted you guys to even though i would only vlog during the daylight that's all gonna change now because now i have new lights and i bought these lights off of amazon i will show you guys later on in the video um they pretty much make up all the lighting in this room now so it's kind of like filming when there is daylight going through my window but these lights are like 10 times better i still want to get a big ring light i still have a lot to do to the room but so far so good um i also got a tripod <laughs> so i'm able to you know film and not worry about the angle not being right or the background pretty much i'm just starting to pick up on all the equipment so i'm just gonna go ahead and end the chit chat here and i'm gonna start the tour um yeah, so you're going to be probably seeing a little bit of the beauty room around my apartment. Um, I'm going to introduce you guys to my bae and to my kids, Levi and Rosie. Okay, so you want to see a tour of my beauty room and my apartment, just go ahead and keep on watching. So the tour is going to start in my beauty room. Um, first things first. So. The lighting. Find the lighting. Find the lighting. Okay, I'm going to have to turn on both lights. Okay, just so you guys can see the difference that it makes. Okay, so these two lights, I got both of them for $75 at, um, on Amazon. Um, so this is pretty much where I film. This is where I sit. Sometimes I move this table. It's pretty lightweight, so I'll like move the table over here, and I'll sit in front of here. Um, so I'll sit right here. So I'm going to go around the room and tell you guys a little about where I got everything. So this chair, I got it um, from, where did I get it from? Oh yeah, so it was for free. I got the chair dumpster diving um, in my apartment for free. The man had literally just put it out and then I went in there and took it. Um, this shelf here, um, my mother-in-law and my fiance Caesar um they're really good like yard sale shopping so she knows where to hit up all the spots so i got this shelf for five dollars um of course the person the heels and everything is mine but the shelf itself was five dollars at a yard sale all the little chachis i bought them actually this school i got it for 25 cents at a yard sale um that i got like at ross ross um walmart i made it myself this arrangement hmm. my fiance bought me this sign at Ross also those are just like pictures so this is like me and my mom my Peppa when he was a baby me and my fiance and that's my whole shebang bang that's my mom and her nine kids and Caesar and this is me and Caesar like a TBT um so let's see what else okay so 
this is my outfit of the day mm -hmm. my little slippers and I am obsessed with these bomber jacket type girly you know not too bomber jacket looking but what ifs okay so here we have this lamp I got it for five dollars out of your so um this was like 25 cents at an old job yard saw that they had I still haven't put pictures in it and it has a little boo-boo but hey I just love the frame this is a white vase I did buy at a yard sale and then this flower was from like a project that I did for one of my friends and I just kept it put it in there this is my old phone oh and this so this little guy I got for three dollars at a yard sale as well um let's see what we have here okay so here this is what i wanted to show you guys I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you guys anyways so me and my fiance are getting married and um i really have said yes to the dress so this is where i got my dress from our lip bridal couture um i can't show you guys any pictures or anything because you know it's my wedding dress but um as soon as you know i start planning the wedding and everything let me just flip but as soon as I start planning the wedding and everything, I am planning on vlogging some of it. Um, not all of it, but most of it. Um, let's see what else. Okay, so right here we have, like I said, this is where I film. Um, this table was on offer up. Let's see if you just kind of see it. So this table was on offer up for ten dollars, and it's an IKEA table, very sturdy, and it's like the glass, not the glass top, but the um. The kind of top that doesn't um, get damaged, like wood, for example. And then my brushes, my makeup. So this is pretty much my whole makeup collection. Um, this little guy was another Yarsel pickup. I mean, I don't mind Yarsel shopping because honestly, I feel like you come up on the best little chachis here and there. But I honestly didn't have no problem buying all my furniture from Yarsel's because I just, I, I will keep telling you guys why. So these are all my palettes here, um, not as much as I would like to have, but enough to get the ones that I really, really want. Um, here we just have Airspun, some Wet n Wild palettes, my eyelashes, my reusable eyelashes, and some that I probably only use once. My most unflattering things, but that I need at my reach, so I leave them there, like face lotion, deodorant, eye drop, um, moisturizer, the face spray Nivea men aftershave balm which if you have bought this because of me or if you have tried it because of me um it's good for like a couple months but then after a while you do notice that your pores are getting huge so I haven't thrown it away because there is times where I will either use it on myself or I feel like a well, one time thing for a client is not bad to keep the makeup on but um I'm not using it every day no more because I just honestly feel like my pores have gotten so huge and I've done reviews and they could say it's because of this. So if you want to, throw it away. If not, use it once in a while. I do not recommend to use it every day like I would. So here I have all my liquid lipsticks. I have the Kylie Jenner new Coco collection, which I will be doing a swatch video for like a swatch video slash holiday video for the Coco collections and I'm still planning on getting some of her holiday collection. I have a lot of color pop if you guys can see. I just don't see I don't see the point of like getting um other liquid lipsticks because color pop always has to happen have like their dupes and stuff. Here I have like a little bit of lipsticks, lippy sticks from color pop, lip liners, um let's see what else. Oh yeah okay so here we have the bottom is my foundation, my beauty blenders, and, you know, just little things like my contact holder. Things that don't fit anywhere else. Um, here I have my eyeshadows and my blushes. This one was a birthday gift from Ulta. I think they gave it to everybody. Um, my ColourPop shadows, my highlight. Oh, this is a highlight. This is not a shadow. This is the Trudeau highlight. And these are my blushes that I honestly just stick to them. Here is all my glitters and my eye products, like all these glitters, my dip brow, my eyeliners, which this eyeliner, I've been having it for like two years now. Yeah, I still use it. I mean, I don't think it causes me any problems. So that's that. And then the top is concealers, um, correctors, primers, eyelash glue, tweezers, you know. 
And then these are my favorite, most favorite makeup wipes. I know that everybody uses the Neutrogena, but these, um, focus for me, please. Okay, anyways, the point is that these say, um, these compared to the Neutrogena makeup remover wipes, and I think they work just as good. I used to buy the Neutrogena ones, but one time I was balling on a budget, so I was like, hey, I'm going to try the Equate ones. That's a Walmart brand, and they work just as fine. So my mirror is kind of dirty, but this is the mirror that I do my makeup in. Um, it has the zoom inside, which is super dirty because that's where I grab the other, this side from. So yeah, this is where I sit. This is where all the mess happens, or this is where all the magic happens when I am filming. Um, so this is what I wanted to show you guys. It is really, really damaged. Um, only because these are makeup stains that I don't want to even try rubbing out. These are strain or burn stains that I don't even want to try burning out or rubbing out but pretty much this is my station that i did start with for this beauty room um most of the things on the counter are the reason that i wanted to find one of those tables versus one of these because i pretty much damaged it just doing my makeup on it and not taking care of it so i'm just gonna paint over it or something and it's like a quick touch up um so this so this chair this chair and let me move my purse. So this chair and this desk I got for free from Craigslist. My sister was staying on it and she was like, hey, they just posted this today. It's a free desk and a free chair for free, like completely free. And we were both we're both looking, we were both looking for vanities set up. So I was just like, oh my god, let's go, babe, let's go. It was actually like the same day that my boyfriend lost his wallet. That's the reason why I remember so perfectly. Um, but yeah, this is pretty much just my desk for now. I don't have like, okay, so for example, this mirror was $3 at a yard sale and it has like this black border with white, but I already have the white spray paint. I just need to actually spray paint it and I haven't, but I will eventually spray paint it, hang it up and then put some lights around it to make a vanity because since I have this awesome lighting, I really don't, I'm not rushing into getting my vanity anymore because of this. So... This is pretty much just where I have like extra stuff. I have a lot of stuff, like too much stuff. Like I don't even know where I would have kept this stuff before. Like this whole room is to myself and I don't know where I used to keep all this shit. But yeah, so here we just have like a little Paris ring holder. Um, this is like a vase I think or a trash can. I'm not sure, but it's gold. And so I just bought it because it was cute. And I put all my like wands and curling irons and brushes in there. This candle, I bought it for like 25 cents, I think, at a yard sale as well. I just have it thrown over here. Um, this is just like little body sprays and stuff. This was from Ross. This is my grandma. I love her. Um, this is my little jewelry holder that I've been having forever. I actually bought this with my sister at Family Dollar. And I just can't seem to get rid of it, even though it doesn't match like everything else. But here's all my chokers and my necklaces. Um, that is my old webcam light that I started off with. I don't think it's connected. But um, the lighting is pretty weak <laughs> compared to these. I don't even, like now I try to sit down in front of this one and see how I used to do it. And honestly, I don't even know how I used to do it with just that light. But, you know, made it work. So these are just like my two little ears. Um, I got these made from a girl off of Instagram that makes them. They, um, at Donut Care, like Donut and then Don't Care, or I don't know. But whatever, she made them for me. Um, these are from Disneyland, blah, blah. Here is my closet. Um, this is just, like, work clothes that I honestly just have, like, to grab and go. Um, my little shoe collection. These are all my boxes that my lights came in and that my slides came in from Lolo Shoutique. This is pretty much just me hoarding because I'm not always too sure if I'm like this stuff or not. Um, here is my little setup that I started with first. Like I'm moving my way towards this side of the room, but I started here first. Um, I already talked to you guys about that. Yeah, so pretty much this is my beauty room. Um, I am going to, I plan on working on it more, but so far this is it. Um, tripod where I was just talking to you guys at. Um, that little mushroom, I also got it at a yard sale. Same yard sale that I got that frame. Yeah, so I'm pretty much a big time yard sale shopper. And every time I tell everybody, I'm proud. I am proud that my whole room is literally under like $20. Except the chachis, they don't count, okay? 
So now we're just going to move on to the rest of the house. So this door leads to my guest restroom. Um, let me see. So this is my guest restroom. And yeah, pretty much. Uh, Levi was just in here because he just pooped. So this is the rest of my house. This is my Peppa. Levi, say hi. Say hi. Okay, this is my kitchen real quick. And then coming to the living room. This is the same door to my beauty room. So the whole restroom like goes around. So this is my dining room slash living room. This is my bae. Say hi, bae. He's really shy because I told him to act like himself and he's not doing huh. that. So this is the tree in our little Christmas section. We just got this little snowman today, counting 24 days until Christmas. And then, where's Rosie? She's usually under the tree. Okay, and then this is him and his football fanatic self. Um, oh, I gotta get an angle from over here. So, this is our living room. Our apartment looks small on camera, but it's pretty spacious. I think it's just the way that we have our couch set up. This is Levi following me and he's born on the floor. This is going on the wall. Okay. We just see that. There is no fucking good lighting in here. What time is it? 9.52? I should have this vlog up and going before midnight. And that still be considered his day one. Where's Levi? I want to show more of Levi. Papa. Let's show more of Levi. I'll probably make vlogs just of Levi. Because he's so, so much to film about him. Can't do it in just one vlog. Peppa! Show him how you jump. Show him. Jump. Not on me. Not on me. Ow. Jump. 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 Oh, yeah. Yeah. Give me your toy. Come on. Yeah, give me your toy. Give me your toy, weirdo. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys how high he jumps. Okay. Oh, oh my god. I'm gonna show you guys how high he jumps. Okay, so here's the stuffed animal, and there he is. Go. Go, Peppa. <laughs> Go. Oh, whatever. This is our dining room for our housewarming party slash first day here. Um, We had a little get together. My aunt bought me these little Frenchie salt shakers because we have a Frenchie. And then, let's see, that's his room right there. More of our kitchen. I'm just gonna give you guys a quick glance to our room because it is not finished and we're pretty much just moving our way in here. But this is my Rosie. Say hi. Say hi. This is, this is her room. We just sleep in it. She's always in here. Levi's always bothering her, harassing her. You know, brother, sister, love. Come on, out. Come on, it's okay. So yeah, that's our room. Moving our way from the living room into the room. But we still need to get a lot more stuff for the living room. Like, once we had to move the TV to put the tree there, we kind of realized that the TV looks better there and we want something there. So we're gonna buy like two extra chairs. Well, I say two, he says one, whatever. We're gonna buy two or one chairs and put it there so it doesn't look so empty. And um, yeah. Oh yeah, and we want to put like a big old mirror or like big old how do you say cuadro in Spanish in English? Frame. Oh, a, whatever. A big old picture, a big old picture with a frame or just a big old canvas, whatever. We're gonna buy one of those. We've seen some pretty cool ones on Amazon. And then here's our stockings. You guys have to look at these. This is Rosie's little stocking and Levi's little stocking. This is our tree. It consists of gold and silver. We wanted to be cool and all the little stars, so we did a glitter bow. Our little snowman, Kenny the Days. Yes, that's pretty much it, guys. Um, Let's see what else. Oh yeah, my kitchen gives really good lighting. This makeup is old. I've been wearing it all day. I didn't get fresh for you guys. Oh yes, perfect, okay. So this green color is a color that I'm going to be using for, I bought it specifically for Christmas. So I'm going to be doing a holiday look with this color. It's like a forest green, really, really dark green. 
Lexi. Can you see? For green, it's um, Dr. M from ColourPop. And I'm going to be doing a makeup look with that. Let's see what else I have here. This is me and Bay. Can you guys see? It doesn't focus. Whatever, it's me and Bay and Rosarito. Out of my purple hair. I'm gonna see, I'm gonna get comfortable on my job and see if they allow me to dye my hair colorful. After the wedding. After the wedding. But by then I would have already been there for like almost a year. So yeah, and this is my kitchen. I'm not gonna show you guys all of the, my kitchen just because it's a kitchen but this is where i get my good selfies sometimes because of the lighting is just uh, sometimes um here's a a little note i once left bay and then bay wrote back so i just left it there because everything's just cute and that's me and him when i first cut my hair and he had his sexy hair slick back okay can you please tell caesar he looks cute with his hair slim back I think he looks cute for his hair so back. <laughs> Anyways, okay. So this is my leftover Olive Guardian. Which I'm going to be attacking right now. To show you guys what I get. Oh, that's kind of gross. Okay. So I'm kind of disappointed because we went to Olive Garden for the first time with Bay for a while. He hasn't really went, so he was offered me to go and I was like of course what the heck so anyways this is Asiago Tortini and chicken alfredo and then these are our appetizers that we get all the time but this isn't gonna be there anymore they were telling me that it was just a promotional plate and it's freaking good it's like my new favorite and now yeah so yeah you know water gotta have water this is my blue dish my aunt got me that's kind of goes with the theme I have going on here which is kind of like turquoise you know well not here but over there in the that part of the kitchen like i have that napkin holder that's like turquoise you know whatever um some sweet and spicy mix that we didn't even know we had because hey. oh my God. did you know we had a sweet and spicy mix we haven't even touched it no, because this big old box of pasta was boxed in it already no. what he murdered it where is the rest Right Levi, give it to me. Give it to me. Drop it. Now. Look at him. He knows he did it wrong. He's like, eh, go. Oh, he's kind of sad. What the bad, you know? Oh, look. He was kind of sad to give it up. He knew he ripped it. <laughs> he has little pieces in his mouth. I'll get it right now. So he killed another one. Sorry. That's my bae. I just think I should introduce you guys to him since he's needs to get comfortable in front of the camera because he's going to be doing the boyfriend does my makeup challenge and we're going to start vlogging a lot so he needs to accept the fact that there's nobody on the other side of this camera but me okay so now that i'm pretty much done showing you guys my whole apartment which kind of just goes in a big circle because the way that the layout is um but as you can see there's so much more to do um, we've been here since April. We love our apartment. It's already coming fast to, you know, go to the next one or, you know, renew the lease or whatever. But we're not sure if we're going to do that or not. This is pretty much just letting you guys into my life because I pretty much just talk about makeup, makeup, makeup on all my videos. So since I'm going to do Vlogmas, I need to start vlogging and start letting you guys know what's up and what's going on. So so that is pretty much it for this video you guys thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed the tour of my apartment um i'm going to be trying and vlog every day um if it doesn't happen don't hate me it's my first time but i just thought i should do it in an honor of it almost being a year for me starting my youtube channel and um yeah so if you guys have any suggestions like any at all on anything that i should vlog about anything i should tell a story about maybe a q and a i'm gonna try and um squeeze all these videos in this month like boyfriend does my makeup my mom does my makeup like vlogging and doing all that good stuff so hopefully wish me luck and um don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already, and I will catch you guys on the next one. Bye!